Hi, this is Dr. Hayek and this video is about chemical equilibrium. In today's video we will talk about the KP and heterogeneous equilibria. This is going to be the second video of the series of five different videos on this chapter. So please refer to the corresponding video for the topic of interest. Now let's discuss the relationship between the equilibrium constant and pressure. So if we consider the uh, expression of the ideal gas law, PV is equal to nRT, we can rearrange this expression to be P is equal to N over V times RT, where N over V is equal to the concentration. So the concentration is going to be equal to P over RT. Now considering again the reaction of Haber process and looking at the expression of K, or sometimes we can see it as KC, and Kp, which is the equilibrium constant involving the use of pressures. So we can see that Kp is equal to the pressure of NH3 to the power 2 divided by the pressure of N2 multiplied by the pressure of H2 to the power 3. Now, if we replace the concentrations of the reactants and products in terms of pressure divided by RT in the expression of K, we get the following expression. So now rearranging this expression, we can find that K is equal to Kp multiplied by RT to the power 2. Now this 2 came from the subtraction between the powers of the reactants it's minus the power of the product. So we can now say in general, if I have a reaction under the following form and I have the K of this reaction or Kc, the way I can find Kp is just to say that Kp is equal to K multiplied by RT to the power delta N, where delta N is the difference between the sum of the coefficients of the products minus the sum of the coefficients of the reactants. Now let's discuss the heterogeneous equilibria. So if we consider the decomposition reaction of calcium carbonate into calcium oxide and carbon dioxide, the equilibrium constant is equal to the concentration of calcium oxide multiplied by the concentration of carbon dioxide divided by the concentration of calcium carbonate. Now, experimentally, it was proven that the position of a heterogeneous equilibrium does not depend on the amounts of pure solid or liquids present. So therefore, the concentrations of calcium carbonate and calcium oxide are constant, and therefore we can rearrange the expression of the equilibrium constant to be only equal to the concentration of CO2. Also, note that the Kp expression is equal to pressure of CO2 only. I hope this video was helpful to you, so please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.